Hello there, Robbie Guy here, and today we're gonna be opening up this Guard Bar tin that we found at Walgreens. I know Pokemon cards are so hard to find right now, and everyone seems to be collecting them or scalping them. I won't, I won't get into it, but let's open some Pokemon cards today and let's go. Alrighty, we are back. We got the tin here. Hopefully, I could open this up here. Get that Guard of War card right there with that beautiful foil pattern with a little bit of a hollow bleed it looks like because you can even see it down here and right above the brilliant search there so a very cool card right there we'll keep that it looks like a little interesting setup here we'll give you guys that online tcg code because you guys know i never use them and therefore you guys who watch our videos here on the channel and we got a interesting pack selection we got crimson invasion burning shadows and sun and moon base set for our three packs out of this tin um very interesting to always open some of the tins at walgreens and wherever you can find them i feel like everyone opens the boxes not a lot of people open the tins um so Let's see how we do. We're just going to kick things off. Let's go. We'll put Sun and Moon in front. We'll start off with that Sun and Moon uh, base set pack right there. Hopefully we get lucky. Hopefully we get to see something cool um, from this pack opening. But we'll just have to be patient and see. Here we go. First pack. We got that Fire Energy. A Passimian. A Rotom Dex. A Piyukumuku, I don't know how to say his name, a Lone Grimer, Rowlet, a Drowsy, a Cutie Fly, Skarmory, Kangaskhan, and then a Masquerin. So we'll put those down there. Just chilling. Having a good time. And we're going to go into Crimson Invasion. We opened a lot of Crimson Invasion on the channel. We had like a booster box where we stretched it out over three videos. Um, it was fun. Like, don't get me wrong, but we opened a lot of Crimson Invasion. So here we go. Let's see here. We got that Water Energy, Fighting Memory, Haunter, a Psychic Memory, a Shellos, a Bunnelby, a Cacnea, a Swinub, a Mankey, a Starmie, and then a Reggie Steel. I always find that artwork very interesting for Reggie Steel. Very cool card. And then last but not least, we got Burning Shadows. Um, hopefully we get lucky. Hopefully we can pull one of the crazy cards from this set. I know there is a Charizard in Burning Shadows. That it would be absolutely insane if we pulled it. And I don't think we're going to pull it with a green code card. <laughs> That's not the look we wanted. But, uh, you know, we can still hope. <laughs> Let's see here. We got that Water Energy. A Gloom, a Seviper, a Lana, a Duskull, a Esper, a Morlul, a Charmander, a Porygon, an Oddish, and then a Mudsdale. So, nothing too crazy in today's opening. Um, we'll just have to wait till next time. Hopefully, we get lucky. I just wanted to bring up that we have our YouTube shorts on the channel. We're doing some Pokemon Go content there. Um, we got our Shining Fates giveaway coming up. And hopefully uh, we get to 500 subscribers soon so we can give that away. The Mad Party pin collection, the Den Dene one. Uh, we get the cool pin. And then Marissa's walking by. She handed me an extra pack. Hopefully we can get lucky with one pack. Hopefully we can get some last pack magic out of this um she was watching in the background there and she was like that was painful so i think it's just one card to the front so let's keep going we got a tauros a score ruppy a waddle and then we will take it um that you have a tell right there for a hollow rare very cool so thank you for watching today's video please remember to leave a like uh it really helps the channel it helps more than you realize uh leave a comment in the comment section let me know what your favorite card was i mean we got to open some pretty cool cards now um that japanese unified minds tag team you know set there as well um and please subscribe to the channel um 
want to get to that 500 subscriber giveaway so we can give away some cool stuff. I think I'm going to do more than just a Shining Fates pin collection as well. I think I'm going to make it almost a mystery box at this point. So, uh, until next time, guys, we'll see you. And uh, next episode, expect to see some Shining Fates being opened. All right. See ya. Bye.